Hey, how you doing? What's going on? Brad Chadwick here again. Uh, a little bit of movie review of uh, actually the Saw series. Yeah, I know I did a video like Bolivar. I hyped up my Saw craze as I have. Um, but I have now finished. I have now watched all of them. Um, and, uh, me and my wife kind of went on a marathon. We watched all the Saws 1 through 6. Um, I've already seen the final chapter. She hasn't. Um, we just got a Blu-ray player, so we wanted to see it in that format. Amazing. It was very awesome. Um, so anybody that hasn't sat down and watched all the Saul's back-to-back, definitely go and do it. You will respect the series more, you'll understand it more, and it'll actually be more of a story. Um, and seeing Saul 6, I, you know, I thought, you know, everybody kept saying it's horrible, it's horrible, it's horrible. But wow. Not horrible at all. Five and six were not that bad. I didn't like, really, you know, I didn't really mind. Um, I'd say probably the worst movie is probably number four. Um, maybe three. Mm, three is really confusing though. It throws you from like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, four is probably the worst out of all of them. Now I go back and watch it. Two is actually pretty horrible too, compared to everything else that happened. So if that tells you anything. You definitely need to go watch everything. <laughs> uh, one through seven. All seven series of Saul. Sit down, watch them. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Wow. So, now as I'm getting ready to talk about this, I want to say spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. I'm going to start talking about all the movies. If you haven't seen them all, don't watch any more past 30 seconds. 30 seconds from now, I'm going to start t talking about the movie. Yeah, so, yeah, sitting down and watch it, it does take, you know, you don't want to watch them all in one day. Me and her did, you know, a couple, like one here, one the next day, you know, then I went to work for a week, and the next weekend came, we watched them two more, you know, we kind of, you know, we kind of separated them, and now when we got to see the final chapter, we'll probably have to wait till the next, uh, my next, you know, days off to, uh, watch the final chapter. Um, but, uh, cause we have to wait for it to come in the mail. <laughs> yes, we're doing the old fashioned come in the mail, Netflix blockbuster thing, so, yeah. Alright, well that's been your 30 seconds, so I'm gonna start spoiling, so you better cut it off right now. Alright, so in the final chapter, Dr. Gordon is back. So you haven't turned it off now, I've already ruined the shit for you, you can't even watch it, fuck it. So Dr. Gordon comes back. Um, and you find out a lot of shit, but so, it's really interesting, you know, going through the whole series, you know, you never really think about Dr. Gordon, and, and I really didn't care, like, I would always, like, read reviews of, of Saul, like, after it came out, to see what happened, what people thought about, you know, the movie when it came out, so I know it was good or not. So I kind of, you know, I kind of thought it was going to suck, you know, the last few movies. Just because the reviews, you know, that uh, kept on uh, coming out. So, I kind of, you know, basically, you know, I thought that they were going to be horrible. So, now as I sit down and watch them all, it's like, wow, they weren't really that bad at all. Uh, you know, I mean, sitting down and watch them, like, separately, like, you know, uh, watch one, I watch two, watch one, I watch two, watch one, watch two, over and over again. Of course, I'm going to like them more. But then, you know, now I've seen five twice. I've seen four twice. I've seen three twice, and now, you know, I've seen three a third time, and I believe I watched them all basically twice, because I watched them when I got them, and then my wife's like, oh, I want to watch them, I want to watch them, so I watched them again, so, you know, there you go, <laughs> so, I mean, it's, it's really, really good series, so if you're down in Saul, you're like, well, I've only seen the first one, and I didn't really like the second one, well, then that's cool, because... Because, I mean, all in all, you know, uh, a lot of people don't like number two. I mean, a lot of people don't. More, more talk about people, uh, talk to people, you know, they say, you know, well, Saw 2 is horrible, uh, blah, blah. Woo! <laughs> well, you know, they don't like it. You know, they didn't really care for it. So, you know, give it a chance. So, all in all, I just want to say, Saw's awesome. Dr. Hoffman looks like a fucking badass. Into the series, I'm telling you, I, I I fucking hated him when I first saw the movie. I'm like, this guy's a douchebag. 
Like, why do they have this guy, you know, in one of the main roles? And he looks, he's stupid. He's the worst actor ever. But, you know, the more you watch the series, the more you watch the movies, you know, you pay, pay a lot of the, pay attention to the characters and what's, their, what's really going on in the storyline and everything. You're like, damn, this dude's a bad mofo. You know, it's like, whoa. So, got to pay attention to the movie. Pay attention really well to every little detail and saw, become a saw addict like I am and really get into the franchise, you know, that was saw, you know, and uh, didn't really get into it. You'll understand the Hoffman characters. I understand why Amanda didn't go as far as what everyone thought she was going to go. Um, I don't think I saw that coming. I really thought she was going to be the, you know, the one. I don't think anybody saw Hoffman being, you know, them throwing like a wild character in there. You know, and then you go back and find out, you know, well, he's helped all along the way. Amanda's helped all along the way. So it's like, what the fuck? And you find out Dr. Gordon helped a lot during the whole entire movies. So, I mean, except for the first one. But, yeah. So, there you go. Thank you, and watch Saul. They're all of them. All of them. And tell me what you think. Comment down below what you think of all the Saul movies. Let me know. Later. Peeps.